"'Twas the night before Christmas, and all through the house, not a creature was stirring, except for me. Uh, 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 I can't fall asleep knowing that Santa's right downstairs probably putting gifts under my tree. Uh, I wonder if he put out the VR headset I wanted. Well, I guess thinking about it won't help. Hmm. I know. I should try distracting him with something else I like. Hmm. Corn dogs. Hot dogs. I'll cut. <gasps> what was that? <laughs> Finally, a good excuse to look downstairs. <laughs> It's Santa! I thought he'd be taller. Wait, what's he doing now? He's going inside my chimney! Oh my god, he flew up my chimney! I thought he'd climb up or something. I can't believe I witnessed that! Well, now that he's gone, I might as well check out my presents. Oh man, look at all these presents! I'm so glad I got this oversized Christmas tree. I don't know if they would have been able to fit on my old one. Oh my god, I bet this one's the giant kazoo I always wanted. And I bet this one's the even more giant kazoo I always wanted. Could this Christmas get any better? Well, maybe I should have waited until tomorrow. Well, good night, presents. <laughs> what? What was that? Huh. Must be hearing my own footsteps. Wait, those aren't my footsteps. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I gotta hide! <gasps> Who's that? Wait, is he taking my presents? Wait, did he just take all my presents? No, 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 no. What? He took them all? Kazoos and everything? No. No, I should have stopped him when I had the chance. ahead of us anyway get him behind i love christmas <laughs> it tickles oh my god look it formed the bridge we try going whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. a hundred 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 dollar bill whoa. benjamin franklin yes you're looking good today hey guys look i can juggle uh. Dad, 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 it's Christmas! I can't wait to see the presents under the tree! <laughs> um, son, actually... Come on! <laughs> wait! <laughs> what? Dad, where are the presents? That was kind of what I wanted to tell you. Oh no, this is like the adventure before Christmas all over again! Yeah, except this one's gonna be 20 minutes shorter than that. What happened to the presents, Dad? Okay, so, this is how it went. I couldn't wait to see all the presents underneath the tree next day, so I didn't. I snuck downstairs and saw Santa putting them under the tree. You saw Santa? Yeah, I know. But after Santa left, someone came and took them. What? Who? They had some kind of cloak. I couldn't see who they were. Did you try to stop them? No, I was too scared. Come to think of it, I wish I did try to stop them. Oh man, that's awful. I wonder if other kids' presents were stolen. Well, actually, I saw a bunch of kids playing with their presents out the window, so... Oh. But who would specifically want to take our presents? I don't know, son. I just don't know. But I know one person who could help us. Really? Who? And they all lived happily ever after. Man, what a great book. I can't thank Sully Bear enough for getting me all these books for Christmas. <sighs> hey, I wonder who that is. <sighs> oh, hey, Sally Bear and Goliath. I was actually just about to go to your... We need your help. My help? What for? We'll talk about this inside. Uh, oh, okay. So, let me get this straight. Someone broke into your house and stole all your Christmas presents? Mm-hmm. And now they're gone forever! Did you, like, call the police or something? What? No, I was way too in shock for that. 
Well, if the police can't track him down, then I guess we'll have to. Well, how are we supposed to do that? Well, simple. What did he look like? Well, he was kind of wearing a cloak, so we couldn't really see who he looked like. Do you remember seeing anything else? Well, I guess when he took the presents, his arm looked kind of green. Green. Wait, Cyber, do you think it's Grinch? What? Grinch? No way! He would never do such a thing! Well, Grinches do have a history of stealing Christmas. What? But Grinch is my friend! I know he wouldn't do anything like that! Yeah, I know Grinch. He doesn't do anything like that. Well, we might as well check. Uh, alright. It better not be Grinch. Alright, let's move out. Uh, brother, you do know where the Grinch's house is, right? Of course I do! I just can't recognize it with all the snow in the way. Hmm, is this it? Oh no, that's Barnesworth's Hotel. Greetings. Oh, hey, ugly bot. I didn't know robots could get cold. There's a lot you don't know about me. Well, anyway, come on, let's keep going. Oh, Grinches, fancy meeting you here. Why is that? Well, you see, my presents were kinda, sorta, stolen in the night. And we have reason to believe that you're responsible. You're talking to Greenigrip, right? Hey! Uh, yeah, mostly. What are you talking about? We never do something like that. Well, the culprit was green, and as Bearson pointed out, Grinches do have a history of stealing Christmas and being green. I can't believe you say that. Just because my dad stole Christmas doesn't mean all Grinches would. Yeah, quit being racist, bruh. Wait, the Grinch is your dad? Uh, yeah. Did you say something believe that I was the Grinch who stole Christmas the whole time we were friends? I'm Ugh. sorry, I'm sorry. Just talking about my son, it's just very emotional. I gotta go over here. Oh, uh, sorry, Grinch and Finch. I didn't know. Yeah. Yeah, you did it. <laughs> Look, Grinches, we're sorry. We didn't mean to hurt your feelings, but we just really need your help. So, please, can you help us? Please? Ugh, fine. Stiba, you're lucky you got such a cute kid. I know I didn't get it from you. Thank you. Wait, anyway, are you helping or not? Not after I hear an apology. <sighs> I said sorry like three times. Oh. oh, in that case, we forgive you. And you can have this Christmas hat to keep you warm. Yeah. Oh. Well, thanks. No problem. Yeah, that hat was originally meant for Chloe, but um, she was visiting family in the mountains, so... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, anyway, come on. You guys gotta help me find the criminal that took my presents. And I have the perfect moat for transportation. Our sled. Alright, guys, hop in. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're not gonna fit. We'll fit. Uh, I regret this so much. All right, fin of it, away! Okay. <laughs> I think my radiator's broken. Cyber, are you okay? Uh, well, that didn't go over well. Yeah, maybe we should stick to the whole speculation thing. Yeah, but how much more can we speculate? I mean, we only know that the robber's green, that's it. Yeah, but there's probably still more clues to this puzzle. Well, obviously, but he was wearing a cloak, so all I could see was his arm. Well, he could have left something behind. Oh yeah, why didn't we think of this before? We could go back and check. Oh yeah, let's return to the scene of the crime. Alright folks, I brought you at the scene of the crime. Oh my god, you're right! This tree's totally bare! Pun intended. What, uh, what pen? Eh, never mind.
Uh, guys, I don't see anything obvious. I found an ornament. Uh, Grinch, there's about a hundred more on the tree. Well, this one's on the ground. You know, Goliath does have a point. This place does seem pretty bare bones. I mean, there doesn't seem to be anything that could indicate anyone in particular. Well, that's because we haven't even started looking yet. Well, after looking at the tree, I'm not very optimistic. Well, I am, so let's start looking. I'll check up here. Uh, yes. Check the span of the whole tree and confirm that there's nothing under here. That's nice, Goliath. Ugh. <coughs> oh, man, it's <coughs> dusty in here. Hmm. hmm. <gasps> Wait, I remember something. What? What, what is, is it? it? <coughs> when I was hiding behind this statue right here, when he was bending over, I noticed that he had blue feet. Blue feet, you say? Man, that's an interesting stuffed animal. Yeah. All right, well, now we know that, that the thief has green arms and blue feet. That's a decent step forward. <laughs> Foot joke. That could still literally be anyone with blue on them and green on them. I mean, I think we're missing the big picture here. Not what they look like, but what they act like. What do you mean, son? Well, just think about it. I mean, an ordinary stuffed animal wouldn't just barge into your house and take all your presents. I mean... It would take a stuffed animal pretty crazy to just break into your house and do that. Just think about it, Dad. Who have you met that is super duper crazy, other than the crazies, that's crazy enough to just barge in and take your presents? Hmm. Just think about it, Dad. Have you met that is super duper crazy, other than the crazies, that's crazy enough to just barge in and take your presents? I know! It must be Chaz! What? No, Legri. Oh, yeah! Let's get that Lego lunatic! Yeah! yeah! Why? Do we even know where he lives? Oh, yeah. oh yeah, yeah. That's a good point, Finch. Well, actually, now that I remember, throughout my encounters with Legri, I never actually asked him where he lived. Yeah, I don't blame you. That guy's a creep. Well, there's no use staying inside. Let's go see if we can find his house. Yee! Away! Well, where to first? Uh, what was that? <laughs> Sounds like a luxury that if I've ever heard one, which I haven't. Yeah, lucky. Follow that sound! Oh, uh, uh, hey! Hmm. <laughs> oh, this way. <laughs> Guys, over here! Huh? Well, looks like we reached a dead end. <laughs> uh, guys, I think it's coming from this pile of junk. Whoa! Is this where Legory lives? It's nice. <gasps> I can't wait to know what all these presents! <gasps> wait, wait, what are you doing here? Legory, I knew it was you! Oh well, you know, since we're friends and all, I thought you wouldn't mind it if I took your presents for one year since I don't get any and all! Man, you never get presents? That's sad. But still, I was looking forward to having those presents. You can't just take them. Aww, okay. I guess you can have them back. Get Legory! Here, have a Lego brick. Oh, this is the best day of my life! <laughs> Man, am I happy to have all my presents back. Also, Finch, that was really nice of you to give him that Lego brick. Well, I did have that Lego brick in my hand this whole entire time, so uh, I thought I would give it to him. You know, you'd make a pretty good Santa, Finch. How do you know I'm not already Santa? Heh, <laughs> good one. Not only is my beard as white as the snow, but it really is the snow. Hey, uh, Rudolph, would you be a deer and reel my beard in? Uh, yes, Santa. 
Oh God, why do I do this all the time? Bye.